All right, so <clears throat> I'm gonna do another uh, example of this FET reactions and rates. So up on the top left, I'm gonna change the setting to mini collisions. So over here I have, you know, my temperature settings and I have the container cleared at zero amounts of anything in here. Over here I have my, my energy diagram and then I have my reactants here and my products here. So I'm going to put in reactant A. So here we go. I'm gonna put like put five of them in there. Okay. And then I'm gonna put in this other reactant B C. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So we're looking for the production of new um, products. So we have more of the molecules in this situation with many collisions going on. So, so far, we do not see any product like A, B, and just the lone C existing in the container. See if we wait a little longer, see if anything happens. All right, so this thing kind of was glitched. So now it, we could look over here too. We could see that the total energy, which is directly related to temperature, is um, kind of low. So like the previous demo, we need to get that energy to exceed this activation energy, you would assume to get a reaction. So to increase the energy, we could increase the temperature. So here we are. See if anything happens. We're looking for a, like a yellow, purple, A, B in there, new product. Still nothing. So we can raise it a little more. See if we see anything. Still nothing's going on. Got many, many collisions. Oh, now we have some. We were able to get this thing to do it and we didn't have to overcome the activation energy. Um, we are able to do it because probably the correct orientations of the collisions played a big role. And the fact that there are so many collisions going on. So there is an increase in concentration of reactants that's also affecting the, the rate of the reaction from reactant to product. If we were to raise the temperature a lot, we should probably see many more products being made. If you were to sit and watch and count them, like here's one right there. There's another one, there's one. So uh, when you raise the energy or raise the energy by the temperature, um, you also increased um, the rate of reaction.